A new twist in efforts to keep the world headquarters of Do It Best Corporation secure in Allen County. Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Jeff Newmeyer joins us live from the Home Improvement Chain's Operations Center in New Haven. And Jeff, I understand some local business leaders, uh, big names, have actually stepped up to try and make sure that company stays put. Yeah, Linda, in Allen County, that's right. Uh, more on that in just a moment. Uh, do it best. Committed to being the anchor tenant in the Electric Works Project in Fort Wayne, but the City Redevelopment Commission uh, early this month canceled an economic agreement with uh, the developers, RTM Ventures, putting that project in jeopardy, fueling speculation that Do It Best might indeed pull out. That worried a group of business leaders, including Sweetwater Sound founder Chuck Surak, and car dealer Tom Kelly, so much that they paid the Community Research Institute at Purdue Fort Wayne to do a study quantifying what Do It Best brings to our local economy. That study found that if Do It Best does move its worldwide operations center, Taking into account new hiring the company's talked about doing and some multiplier factors, it would cost Allen County the equivalent of 833 jobs and more than $117 million per year for the local economy. You'll hear from Surak and County Commissioner Nelson Peters, but first, the person who performed the study about the value of Do It Best's jobs. Now we actually have solid numbers to attach to that conversation and say, these are worth holding on to, and how do we do that? Especially because Do It Best Corporation has expressed interest in staying here. If you look at you know the Charlottes and the Philadelphias and the Austin, Texas, they all uh, have multiple worldwide headquarters. That, that's what we want to get back to in this community. You can just imagine that there are states all over the country would love to have them bring their headquarters to their community. And I've heard there's even offers within our state to move them from Fort Wayne. And so we just cannot allow, as citizens of Fort Wayne, we can't allow them to leave our area. Now, Surak believes Do It Best CEO Dan Starr and other top management are okay with uh, staying here in Allen County, but Surak says the board of directors with no real ties to Fort Wayne could call the shots on this decision, so it's hard to say what they might do. It's worth noting that in the past quarter century, Fort Wayne felt the sting of losing two other key worldwide headquarters, Lincoln Financial Corporation and Central Soya. Do it best, uh, declined comment for our story today. Do we know if the company would actually pull out and move elsewhere? We certainly do not know that, but if Electric Works gets rescued and Do It Best does stay put locally, I think a lot of folks would be sleeping easier. Uh, Linda, Tom. Yeah, I think you're right about that, Jeff. The ripple effects would just be monumental. We'll keep watching this story closely. Thanks for that live report.